Hey guys, this is Take It Out, and today I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak iOS 11.4 to iOS 11.4.1 with the newly released Electra jailbreak. So, let's get started. Okay, so first what you want to do is head to the first link in the description and open it in Safari. Go to tweakboxapp.com and click install now. Click allow, install, type in your password, click install, and then done and it'll take you back to Safari, and you can exit out, and then Tweakbox will be on your home screen. So once you're in it, just click I Accept, then go over here to Apps, Tweakbox Apps, and Electra iOS 11.4.1, then here click Install, and install again, and it's going to start downloading. It did it really extremely fast for me over here. So now you need to go to Settings, go to Profiles and Device Management. You should already be in it, but if not, go to Settings, General, Profiles and Device Management, and then find the one with Electra, click Trust, Trust again, and then Electra will be on your home screen, and you should be able to open it up just like this. Now, I do need to point out that I would recommend backing up your device before this just in case it winds up breaking your device or anything like that. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get this over with and hit the jailbreak button. So, to ensure optimal success, it is recommended to let to run Electra immediately after a reboot. Okay, so let's go ahead and let it jailbreak, I guess, even though I click cancel. So it says to do it immediately after a reboot. So let's go ahead and restart our device. So I'm going to restart it here. Okay, and my phone has booted up. So now we are going to go ahead and run Electra over here. So now we're going to hit jailbreak. And it says, please wait, one of three. So it may take a minute, and it may take a few tries. I'm not sure the success rate of the exploit looks like it's doing okay so far. But it might have just crashed on me, I'm not sure. So it didn't respring, so I'm going to assume that it just crashed, because most of the time that is the case. But like I said, it may take a few tries, so let's try it again. Okay, so I do not see Cydia anywhere, so let's go ahead and run it again. Okay, now it is installing Cydia, so it should be working, I hope. And Cydia is now on my home screen and opened up immediately. Congratulations, you are now jailbroken. So thank you so much guys for watching this video. If you have any questions, please leave them down in the comments below. And as usual, I'll try to get to them as soon as I can. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and subscribe to my channel so you can see more videos like this. And if you feel like being extra awesome, go ahead and drop a like on this video. Again, thank you so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.